In this video, I will go over the process of utilizing JS Services Analytics to create a more systematic approach to trading and show a general practical application of the service. Hello, my name is John Slazis. I started JS Services while working on the Chicago Exchange floors over 30 years ago. Back then, you could literally feel the emotion of the market and JS Services used technical analysis to identify levels that define behavioral turning points. Futures trading is a zero-sum game, and face-to-face -face trading demanded integrity. Those wanting to join the club had to be approved by a committee to become a member of the exchange, and anyone that was credible was registered with the NFA. Today, for many new traders, this level of integrity is lost and only kept in check with karma. Being registered, however, is more important than ever, as it's the only way to cut through all the false experts which cloud the clarity that is needed to trade effectively. As the markets changed and moved off the floor, they became dominated by large funds and algorithmic traders. JS Services Analytics adapted to this structural shift by taking a completely quantitative analytical approach. The years of behavioral observation were not discarded, however, but became variables in a mathematical equation. The result is a fact foundation that provides structure to create a systematic approach and the context to bring back the gut feel of intuitive knowing that gets lost in electronic trading. In this video, I'm going to go over JS Services desktop application and show how you can use it to optimize your current method. Before we get into it, I want to be clear on what JS Services analytics are and how they differ from most analytics that are available. Fundamental analytics study the cause of market movement and are typically broad general themes, not effective for short-term trading. Technical analysis studies the effect of movement, and its strength is that it's adaptable to any asset class and the same techniques are applicable to different time dimensions. Real-time and historical data are readily available, so it's easy to get into, and there are a lot of practitioners. The weakness of technical analysis, however, is that it's subjective, it's complex, and it's full of conjecture. Bottom line, technical forecasts or levels generated by an expert are basically opinions. The problem with opinions is everybody has one, and you cannot create a systematized approach based off an opinion. Quantitative analysis, however, is objective facts based on market truths and probabilities which provide a solid foundation to create a sustainable trade plan. JS Services quantitative analytics are divided into three sections that act as layers which create a foundation of increased clarity to the market's current technical foundation by identifying its state, structure, and inherent strategy themes. JS Analytics serve as the basis to standardize trade plans and provide a systematic approach to trading standardized to cause to conform to a standard. Before you can standardize your method, you need to identify it. Generally, as a directional trader, your methods or tactics will be classified as either trading with momentum, trading against momentum, or an exhaustive reversal. If you have not done so already, you should identify every trading tactic and decision process you make to execute a trade as either a breakout, fade, or reversal classification. To systemize your approach, you want to standardize your method by aligning it with JS Analytics with the goal of creating a more sustainable trade plan. The key is to know the facts associated with the underlying state. By knowing the market state characteristics, it will improve your awareness and provide a basis to standardize a trade plan. Market state is the playing field that the drama of the trading day is going to play out on. The nuances and tells, or facts associated with the state, are the foundation to standardize your method. Knowing the facts improves awareness, making it easier to sync your gut feel with real-time events. JS Services Market Color Analytics identify the current market state and its unique characteristics. These characteristics provide insight to how price action should behave within the session so tactics can be aligned to these facts. Once you have identified the market state characteristics, you need to align them with your method. Put your tactics into the fade, breakout, and reversal buckets and know what condition price action, expectations, and attributes complement them. 
Know which state or attributes are ideal for your method or the ones that you prefer to trade and start to create a rank value. Identify the ideal market structure for your method. How an opportunity is valued in terms of size management and signal acceptance is critical to sustainable trade plan. By identifying the ideal state and structure that complement your method, you will not only have a better awareness to when real opportunities are occurring, but will have a systematic way of executing it. What is market structure? Market structure defines the alignment of the state condition. JS Services Price Map Analytics identify the framework which defines the structure of the market state. It is at these points of inflection where shifts in market state occur. For a non-trend market state, it defines the digestive extremes and the point at which non-trend state will either hold structure and persist or break structure and transition to a new market state condition. By knowing these facts, trading opportunities can be anticipated. The price map provides objective structure which can be used to align trading tactics. Market structure is not support and resistance. Market structure is the technical alignment of the market state. Market structure not only defines the structure of the state, but it also improves awareness by adding additional clarity to the bias of the current condition, which will skew the characteristics of the current state. Basically, a higher resolution picture to improve alignment and standardize your method to a state condition with a specific structure. Each market state is defined with three price points, a critical range and a sentiment bias or what we call the R level. The critical range is the hard boundary that outlines the structure that defines each state. The critical range provides insight to when shifts in state will occur by identifying where they will occur. The sentiment bias or R level is the price level where the bias for the trade period shifts from positive to negative and vice versa. It is the level with the most influence for the trade period where liquidity is the highest, risk is the lowest, and reward the greatest. This fact further defines the market state characteristics by its position on the price map and is the level with the most influence for the trade period. For example, an R level below the market in a bull trend indicates a positive sentiment bias and is in alignment with the state characteristics and has a trend continuation expectation. An R level above the market in a bull trend indicates a negative sentiment bias and is in conflict with the state characteristics and has a corrective expectation. Each structure defines a unique environment that can be used to standardize a trade plan or method. What JS Analytics provide more than anything else is awareness. Awareness to the facts of the conditions and its structure. By aligning your method with market structure, you standardize the execution of your tactics and a more systematic process to your approach. The final layer of analytical alignment is the market strategy themes that are inherent in the state and structure dynamic. If a market is in a certain state with a specific structure, then it will have a set of specific strategy themes that should be anticipated to dominate price action. JS Services Playbook Analytics combined 26 market state conditions, each with nine sentiment skews, for a total of 234 potential strategy themes or plays. The playbook plays are divided into optimal and hedge strategy themes. Methods can be standardized to themes that complement tactics. Optimal strategies are themes that will dominate price action when the market holds structure of the state. These are best as they are in alignment with the characteristics of the state, and the expectation of how they should perform is clear because the state is known. For a size management system, whose max is three units, this would be a three unit trade. Hedge strategies are themes that look to participate in potential transitional shifts in state when a market breaks structure of the current condition. Markets are in a constant transition from one state to the next, but how they do it is not as clear because it's not known what state the market is transitioning into. Shifts in state can be dramatic and provide significant opportunity, but the lack of clarity to what characteristics should be anticipated balances the reward 
and makes this a two unit trade. Other opportunities that are not defined in the playbook strategy, optimal or hedge themes, if aligned with the context of the state and structure under this size management approach would be a one unit trade. The playbook strategy themes, like your tactics, are classified as fade, breakout, and reversal. The naming schema is as follows. An optimal strategy that's buy our fade is you want to buy the market using a fade entry technique at the R level. By aligning your fade tactics to the playbook strategies, you have a standardized approach to when to use tactics as well as a systematic way to define the proper size to allocate to the trade. Specific strategy themes are inherent in the state and structure alignment, which provide a standardized approach to systematically apply a trade plan across all markets. Align your method with a strategy theme that complements your tactics. For example, if your method is to trade with momentum and you like conditions that are pivotal, with pivotal structure that can produce big movement with a strategy theme that signals a breakout. As you align your method with JS Analytics, you standardize your approach, which provides a systematic way to apply value to an opportunity and to optimize your tactics and the risk management that you want to apply. By standardizing the trade plan or method with JS Analytics, it makes them sustainable JS Services desktop application can be used to normalize the approach and make them more consistent. Knowing the nuances of the market state is key to align tactics. A neutral digestive state is typically thought of as a market that is trading sideways, but it can also be the precursor to a breakout as the coiling action will build power. A typical sign that sentiment is going to change from neutral digestion to trend is signaled early in the session by a trend move with no break in positive or negative structure. I like to first view the critical range and R level on a daily chart to put some context to the bigger picture. This is something to keep an eye on throughout the session as it represents the foundation for the trade period and can help to avoid getting caught up in the noise. JS Services objective quantitative analytics overlaid on the historical price action provides structure to any other subjective technical analysis. As we drill down into the facts and observe interday price action within the market structure, we become more aware if the market is performing to the characteristics of the state expectations or not. We have standardized our method with this state and structure as it's in alignment with our pivotal trend breakout tactics. In this market structure bias, with sentiment in the middle of the critical range, it signals the potential for a turning point in the current market state. This is a dynamic signature state with the potential to spark a low volatility one-way trade for the balance of the session, or a sideways rotational trade around the critical range midpoint. Look for the market's ability to build structure or not as the tell. The current price action is coiling above the R level with the potential to produce a turning point session. The fact that the market has been holding above the R level in early market trading is positive, signaling that the pound is in a buy R breakout hedge strategy theme. As long as this remains true, the opportunity is to the upside. As the market starts to build positive structure, our trade vision is clear as the price action is performing to the expectation of the state, which is more likely to produce a low volatility one-way trade into the close if the market maintains positive price structure. Knowing the expectation of the state allows you to align your tactics and create a systematic approach to entry, exit, and position management of a trade opportunity. By standardizing the process, you create the plan that is sustainable. Every market that's in a neutral digestive state with sentiment in the middle of the critical range has pivotal structure. A tell for a potential breakout session is if it is coiling around the R level early in the session. Standardizing your method to this fact creates a foundation for a systematic trading approach. JS Analytics are the strategy foundation for your trading tactics. Please send any questions to info at jsservices.com. I look forward to working with you.